folks, welcome back to another episode of my YouTube channel. I gotta tell you, I love what we're building here. This is special, it feels way more like a family and interacted than a lot of my other businesses, and that's why I respond to everybody as much as possible. Yeah, I'm telling you, it literally comes to my phone. I sit here and I respond to everybody and I read the feedback, and a lot of the feedback that I've been getting is, you guys flipped out over episode one, the day in the life. And so I wanted to give it to you, but I wanted to give it to you with a little uh, different flavor, which is a weekend. I actually ended up looking at weeks as seven day weeks, not five and then two days off. It just wasn't something that I would be able to accomplish what I wanted to in that amount of time. So ever since I was you know, leaving the mail room, uh, I said I got seven days to accomplish everything that I have to. Now, since I've had a family, of course, I want to spend as much time as possible. And I know a lot of you are going to watch this and you're going to say, Josh, it's a weekend. Just spend time with your family. But I'm a yes guy. And that means, yes, I want to work. And yes, I want to spend time with my family. So how am I going to be able to accomplish that all in one day? I'm going to take two days and I'm going to put it into one. Come four o'clock, it's family time. And that's it. I don't want to deal with anything else uh, after four o'clock. So I really got to try to squish it in, which is not easy. This works for me, and it may or may not work for you, but I want you at least to see it, and then figure out what is gonna work for you. All right, so this is a day in the life on a Saturday. I'm very excited for you guys to be rolling with me today. Let's do this, huh? All right, you ready? We're gonna fly. We're gonna fly, fly like angels. Woo, come on. Here we go. Little princess. One good girl. Good girl. Whoa. <laughs> Saturday, what a day. All right, here's how we're gonna start it. I'm gonna go meet an agent right now for a very big deal that is very, very close to being done. It's a $10 million deal, $250,000 commission. That's some major money. But what we're gonna negotiate is the lease back and a couple other little items. There's a lot of little things that are gonna make or break a deal. And I can tell you the main thing that makes or breaks a deal is ego. So we're gonna to try to leave that aside here. You don't wanna work against each other. You wanna work towards each other for success. Up early when the sun is out, not setting out my own soul, but those real ones, they coming now. Uh, hey. Hey, how are, how are you? you? Good to see Good. you again. How's that been? Great. We got to close this up. Okay. We're kind of like battling here. And, and listen, mm -hmm. you know, we both have the same intentions, which is to close the deal. Your buyers love the house, mine wants to sell. Definitely. But I feel like there's just a lot of cooks in the kitchen, so we're kind of banging heads here. Okay. How do we get past the furniture deal and how do we get past the lease back? Look, you want $300,000 for used furniture. My clients will pay $50,000 max, that's it. It was, it was $700,000 when you bought it. We're giving you over a 50% deposit on what it's worth. This is like top of the line Italian custom made furniture. I understand it's two years old. The guy's never even home. They don't care. They don't care. $50,000 and we're done. But he's going to end up just putting it on the internet and selling it for $150,000 or $200,000. Let him do it. He's not going to get 150 grand. Josh, 50,000, let's close this deal. We're so close. What if we do this? I will work on the furniture, but I need you to give in as far as the lease back. My guy's been here for 35 years. He can't, he, he can't leave in four days. I know you guys want to close quickly. It, it's not doable. Okay, you give us the furniture for 50,000 and we'll give you two weeks for free. A month. Two weeks, 50,000, let's make a deal happen. You yelled at me this morning. I'm, I'm, I'm hurt. And I can tell you in a smile. <laughs> <laughs> fine, All fine. right. Deal? All fine. right. Good. Okay. Good. Fine. All I right. gave you the furniture. You gave me the lease back. We're Perfect. good to go. We're good. All, All right. right. I love it. See you at closing. All right. Thank you. Okay. What we just did here, you got to realize I went into this negotiation with two points that, that were sticking points for both clients. So what I did with Amy there, who's also a great agent, is I gave her the furniture so they felt like they got a win where really all I really cared about was the lease back, which is what I got, and that's how I got my win. I walked away happy, thinking that I won, 
She walked away happy thinking that she won. That's the sign of a true, very good negotiation where all parties are happy. And no one should walk away feeling like they got better than the other. And that's it. $10 million deal. That's got to be the first $10 million deal on YouTube. Am I right? We're going to check that out. I'll see you guys. I'm pumped. Okay, I've been working like three jobs. Probably why I never see ya. Probably why I never have time for the fake friends I won't be ya. Oh God, I've been running now. Up early when the sun is up. So in fact, zoom out. Zoom out for this. Here you go. Altman Brothers' new office. We wanted to make that move to do this uh, years ago, but we, we really wanted to wait till the right time, and now was the right time to do it. Let's do it. You want to see inside? I'm not even sure if we have lights. Yeah, we do. We do. We do. We are designing it as kind of the Mad Men feel, the kind of New York, mid-century, modern yeah. lounge. You know, of course, this is part of the Saturday. We have to make some decisions today that Matt and I are going to talk about uh, because the people on Monday need to move forward one way or another because otherwise we're costing time and costing money. Custom hat, Douglas Elman, Heather Altman, Altman Brothers. Yeah, we're going to need to move that over there. Brothers have arrived. Robertson Boulevard. Okay. While Matt and I were just at the office, I actually got the final documents signed, sealed, and delivered from Amy, the other agent on the deal that I met with this morning, which means that we are now on the way to go see my client, Jerry, uh, at his house to congratulate him that we're about to close his 10 million dollar sale. My paychecks get a little bigger, but that don't change me or make me richer. Money coming, the money go, but my guy's here when he's staying with you. Blowing up off the internet. Hey, Josh. Jerry. How you doing? How are you? Good, how are you? Congrats. Hello. Thank you. Very excited. Oh, guys, this is Jerry, one of my favorite clients. Hi, brother. Uh, lives up in my neighborhood, up here in the Hollywood Hills, and... Uh, uh, actually, today is a very special day. I'm going to give you guys a tour, and Jerry's going to give you a tour because he built this house and he's been here for a long time. But this is what we call the actual key exchange give back. So, this key is how I show the house when Jerry's not here for every showing. I don't have to sell the house. I don't have to show the house anymore because, well, we sold yeah, it. Yeah, we don't have to show it anymore. And you don't have to show it. He's, he's tired of me. <laughs> he's tired of me. So, number one, here's the key. All right, thank you. You're the best. Come on in, guys. Investment. So this view is second to none at night. Like when we show the house at night, people flip out. Because it's like a jewel. It's a yeah, jewel. Yeah, you should always be a bunch of diamonds out there. So I'll tell you something funny, uh, which is actually rare in a deal. Um, the buyer, uh, the buyer, when you say the buyer doesn't like him. Oh, no question, bro. They think you're too hard to sell. <laughs> <laughs> he does not like you. He does not like me, so the buyer, uh, because I played some serious hardball on that buyer, I called his bluff, and uh, uh, he then asked if it was okay, his agent, if they can just talk to uh, Jerry directly, because uh, they didn't want to deal with me anymore, because I was too hardcore. Pretty much true. <laughs> and we did have a backup offer, so we decided that we weren't going to give him one dollar. And at the end of the day, they gave in and we closed the deal, and everybody's happy. They're getting a great house and a great I'm deal. I want to win. <laughs> I love Jerry. He's like me. Mom, money, mom, money. I guess we're done. And uh, uh, hold that thought. I got some. Yeah. This was a good deal. 
I'm proud of this deal. This is my hood. Uh, I know you have a fetish for expensive cars. Maybe. I love it. Even though I know you prefer, prefer Bentleys. No, no, no. I got Rolls. I'm a Rolls guy. Well, that's all Rolls. Oh, I love it. Are you kidding me? Jerry, you're the best. I appreciate it. Very, oh, so this is all Rolls Royces. Yeah. The okay. history of it. Yep. All right, well, I'm on my, my seventh one, so I love it. Thank you again for the book. I appreciate it. Now, just because you're a legend in real estate, you've been in the game a long time, and I learned stuff from you, what is some advice that you can give to the people watching this today? If you build a house, build it with high ceilings and take advantage of every piece of view you can get up. Well, there you go. We'll see you guys soon. Thanks, Jerry. Okay. Talk Thank to you, you later. All right. On to the next one. Thanks for being with me this Saturday. We accomplished a lot. Uh, now it's actually even earlier than I thought. It's about 3.30, so now I'm gonna head home. I got my parents coming over. I'm gonna shower, I'm gonna shave, I'm gonna uh, uh, get ready to surprise them because I have something special to tell them. And I'm gonna actually bring you with me for that. What a day, what a good Saturday. You know, I feel, I feel like I accomplished a lot and I closed a $10 million deal on YouTube. That never happens. My God, I, I, I actually, you know what? I'm gonna try to close over $100 million deals just on YouTube alone this year. Be part of the 600 million that I sell. What do you think? Wow, beautiful. This is Yours does a team. looks like you lost weight. I can't <laughs> tell it's actually. I've got a little more on since. Did you see you guys? You have a good fight? Yes, I slept most of the time. Yeah, you know, it's fine, but that's good. Fine, fine. Yeah, we, oh, you came from New York. We came. Oh, yes. Josh. Say, look, my shirt. Look at my Look at my Oh, wow. Can, Can I have Lexi? Can, Can I have it? Give it to Dada. That was Do I have another one for Lexi? Special. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Do you want to share it with Mama? Here, Lexi. You want some water? Can you take this? No. Thank you. <laughs> there you go. Here we go. Excuse me. Excuse me. What? Excuse me. <laughs> Will you read the T-shirt? Oh, here we go. <laughs> I never really <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Yay! Yay! Always over my head for God's sake. Yay! Yay! So when do we think we're due? Sometime in July. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> we, have, we have no trips. We have no trips. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well that was it. Just surprised my parents with the news of baby number two. Uh, you saw my mom's reaction was hysterical. Exactly what I thought it was gonna be. I'm glad you guys got to catch that moment. Super special to us. So now I'm gonna hang and celebrate. So I love you guys, but I gotta go. Bye.